guys and welcome to another episode of Bubba's Garage. Today, well, we're going to change things up a little bit. Today, we're putting the entire lighting project on the winter edition on hold. Slightly. Just slightly, just for a moment because we got something different that we want to try out. It's definitely different. I'm not really sure how this is going to turn out, but, well, if you want to find out, then we need to get started. I'm really curious. I'm not gonna lie, a little scared too. It, it is a little scary. It is a little scary. Is. Who can tell she's like all worried over here? Uh, so I, I, let, I'm not gonna lie, it's it's different. Let's go out, let's go out to the garage, and let's take a peek at what it is that we have that we're gonna be installing right here on Bubba's Garage. Let's go. That's right guys, we have the Gladiator Vader Grill by Oxmart right here. Yes. This is designed to fit a 2007 to 2017 Jeep Wrangler. That could be a Sport, a Rubicon, a Sahara, doesn't matter, two door, four door, it doesn't matter. It will fit all of those. Guys, this thing looks mean. Just sitting right here, it looks mean. When I'm we curious. get this installed, I'm it's gonna curious. be a beast. Yeah. It's going to be a beast. Before we do that, let's just talk about the product itself oh, and yeah. then we'll move on. This is actually really impressive. I mean, it feels more sturdy than what's factory. Yeah, the ABS is pretty heavy duty. I'm definitely impressed with that. Uh, I'm even more impressed with the accessories that come with the grill. And you it got comes your push, with the push pins. pins push and pins. it comes with the clips. So you don't have to reuse what's yeah. on your Jeep, right. and it comes with a weather seal as well. Yeah. So that's pretty. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, that's really good. I mean, that's that's really nice. And the cool thing is, is you can take your grill, uh, factory grill, or another grill that you have, and you can set it aside and change this out again later. But right now, we're going to take, we're going to install this on the 2017 Jeep Wrangler Winter Edition. See how it looks, and well, let's uh, let's let's see how beastly we can be. Let's do this. <laughs> guys we have the original grill off of the Jeep right now one of the most important things you need to do is remove your blinkers and the keep housings. in mind that the housings are specific to right hand and left hand very There's important mar they're marked so keep track of which side is which yep in addition they have these little clips so you're gonna want to press these little clips in when you remove it and then it'll just slide right, slide out. right out just mm -hmm. don't let it fall on the ground don't no. let it fall so you're going to reuse these you're going to install those on your new grill in addition to six clips one two three four five and six yes. really easy then you're going to snap it all back in place <laughs> Okay, the last step to your Gladiator grill install is actually sticking this little weather strip up here. And what I want to explain to you is there's this line that runs down the grill where it's molded. You're going to want to stay against that line all the way down the grill.
All right, guys, that wraps up the install of the Gladiator Vader Grill by Oxmart. If this is the kind of grill for you, definitely do me a favor. Check the link there in the description. There's a link there to Amazon where you can actually purchase this. Now, keep in mind, it will fit a 2007 to 2017 Jeep Wrangler. That can be a two-door or four-door. It works on the Sports, the Rubicons, and the Saharas. What do you think? I was thinking that I wasn't going to like it at all. It yeah. was, it's different. I mean, you guys know, you guys follow us right here on Bubba's Garage, and this is kind of like not our thing. This is not something that we've done before. It's definitely different. You know, I think the thing here is, is if you're looking for mean and aggressive, this has definitely got it. Yeah. You got to be okay with losing that seven slot Iconics Jeep grill. That's yeah, a tough one. That, tough that is one. very, very tough. Uh, but you know, the, that's one of the nice things about a Jeep is you can kind of do whatever it is that you want to do and people aren't going to hate you for it. I mean, it's, <laughs> I mean, in the end, it's a Jeep thing, right? So, uh, I mean, you know, that, that iconic grill, that's tough for me a little bit. I love the look, the aggressiveness in it. It, it does look really good. I, I want to do some painting to it. Yeah. Definitely want to do some painting. But yeah, yeah. So, I mean, honestly, value for the money though, I mean, if this is what you're looking for, this is the look, I would have to give it a five value for the money. Oh, absolutely. It's a high quality ABS plastic. Yes. It comes with the additional things that you would need to install it. And it's under a hundred bucks. And it was a great fit, man. Some of those clips went on, they were tight. It, it was it's, great. It's a, yeah. good, it's a good fit. I think you're definitely getting your value for your money here. In addition to, well, you get the box. So keep the box and take your <laughs> other grill, put it in the box, use the same paper, everything, wrap it up and store it away just in case, well, it comes summer because right now it's winter and you want to change that little fella up. Yeah. So guys, we're gonna wrap up this video right here, right now. If you guys like this video, do me a favor, give us a huge, huge, huge thumbs up. And if you really like this video and you wanna stick around and find out what happens next right here on Bubba's Grass, do me a favor, please subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you on the flip side. Good night, everybody. Good night.